Hey guys, what's going on? It's Alan here with another video. So today we're going to touch on some basics for aiming and consistency and uh, anchor points and stance as well. So it's going to be actually a kind of important video. This is basically to try and improve your consistency and how to aim, uh, well tips rather, on how to aim in uh, traditional archery, okay? So uh, we're going to jump right in and uh, this is how I do it anyway. And this is not tips for instinctive archery, so if you're, if you're trying to get into instinctive archery, this probably isn't the right video for you. This is more of a beginner's guide, so we'll go straight into it then. Um, first thing I want to talk about is the stance, okay? You're going to want to have your knees bent. Um, and bear in mind as well, your form is going to have to be uh, really good in this to get this to work. So you're going to have to practice what I'm doing here to get this, uh, to be able to do this accurately. But it only takes a little bit of time, as long as you get it down, it shouldn't be uh, too hard at all. But uh, Anyway, you, you bend your knees ever so slightly. And what I do is I put my three fingers underneath the arrow knock as so. Um, I pull the arrow knock until it's under my right eye, which is my dominant eye, like so, as you can see. And as I'm doing that, I'm aiming uh, down, so I've closed my left eye and I'm aiming down sight at the target. Now, I'm, I'm actually not looking down the arrow, but I'm looking directly at the target where I'm aiming and I can actually see the arrow tip in my peripheral vision and trying to line that up with the target uh, without actually looking directly at the arrow is, is how it kind of works. It's hard to explain but I'll try and show you what I mean in a little bit, okay? But in the meantime, uh, while you're doing that, when you're at full draw, we want to use um, your back to leverage uh, the muscles so you don't injure yourself um, and so everything is aligned properly, okay? Now, how this works is, it's, it's kind of hard for me to explain but I'll give it a go. It's like uh, you might hear the word back tension used a lot if you watch other archery videos and stuff like that. And um, the best way I can explain this is um, when you're at full draw, like here with your right arm, feel like, imagine someone's pushing your elbow backwards, okay? Okay. That wasn't professional, but yeah, you have your arm like this, and imagine someone's like kind of pushing it back like that. So it doesn't do anything here, it's just pushing it back like this. And at the same time, when you have this arm forward, like so, you're kind of pushing that one so maybe it's better like this. It's kind of pushing this one forward a little bit like that so it's stretched out, you know? Um, and that's kind of leveraging your back muscles there. And once that's in alignment, when you then release, um, the arrow should hit the target where you're aiming. Now, if it goes up or down, that doesn't really matter. That just means you have to adjust where you're pointing the arrow tip. But if it goes left or right, it means you're not in alignment and you need to work on your form to get that perfect. So I'm going to take a few shots here. Um, hopefully you'll be able to see the form here, we'll go at a different angles and then um, we'll go and see what else we can do. But that, that should be ba the basics here, okay? Hopefully uh, this will help you, but we'll, we'll see how we get on, okay? So. Okay, I messed up on the last shot a little bit in terms of I was aiming a bit uh, lower than I meant to and the arrow went lower, but they're all pretty much in a line. So I got the alignment right, they're basically um, right on centre. So that's that's kind of what we're looking for now. We'll try it again at a different angle just so you can maybe see more that you didn't see here. And then uh, I'll leave it there for that. But uh, hopefully you found it helpful anyway. And I'll be right back. Hey guys, we're back. So uh, let's get going.
and there we go and as you can see it's fairly consistent so uh i think that's pretty good um hopefully guys you found this helpful and uh, thanks for watching and have a nice day all right